Hi everyone, this is Karen. In this Silhouette tutorial, I'm going to teach you what to do if you have been using Silhouette Studio for a while, but now you've got a new computer and you want to install the program on your new computer. The first thing you need to do is go up to the Help menu and choose Deactivate License Key. This is so that when you go back and install again, you'll still have all the um, install permissions that you have. You have permission to install the Designer Edition up to three times without having to contact Silhouette Studio. They will probably reset that for you um, if you have some issues, but you would have to contact them for that. So make sure that you deactivate your license key so that you'll be able to reinstall it and still have all of your three ins reinstalls. If you no longer have your license key information, all you need to do is come into the Silhouette Store and look up your Silhouette Studio keys in this area over here. It's under My Account. Click My Account and then you'll see the Silhouette Studio keys here in this area. So you can write down your key, then you'll be able to re-enter it once you've installed your software. Then if you're using version 3, you can export your library and import it again in your new install. If you don't do this, you'll have to download all your, your uh, designs again, but you're allowed to do that three times without having to contact Silhouette. Again, they will reset that for you, but getting in touch with them can be a little bit difficult. If you're using version 2, there is no export option. If you are running version 2, you'll need to come into the Silhouette store, click on My Account, and then choose the option over here where it says recover all downloaded designs. That will put everything back into your library for you and you're allowed to do that up to three times. The other thing is that if you do have version 3 and you're using the export option, export will only export the files that you purchased from the Silhouette store. If you got your files elsewhere or if you designed your own files, those will not be included. You have to save those on your computer, on your hard drive preferably on an external drive. If your computer should crash and is due to the hard disk failing and you've saved all of your files, all of your designs, photos and everything on an external drive, then the computer crashing won't affect that because you'll still have all of your files on a separate drive. If all of your files, your photos and your designs are stored on your main hard drive, then if that crashes, they're gone and if you wanted to recover them it can cost you quite a bit to do that. On a Mac it's super easy to do backups. All you need to do is come into Time Machine. I'm going to show the Time Machine preferences. I'm actually doing a backup right now. Um, and you turn on Time Machine and then you select the disk that you want to use for that and automatically Time Machine will back up every hour only the things that you've changed so there's no worry ever about not having a backup. Um, I haven't used Windows as my main operating system for a very long time. It's got to be about 10 years and back then um, you had to purchase a backup program to have that feature. I would guess that by now Windows also has integrated backup software so that you don't have to purchase something extra but I don't know any details about that. So once you've backed up your files either using Time Machine or by doing an export and I'm going to run through the export to show you how that's done. So to do that all you do is you click File, Library and then Export Library. I'm just going to put that into my temp drive because I actually don't use the library and I don't need this. So I'm just going to create a new folder for that. I'm going to call it my Silhouette Backup and then I'll just let, let it name it My Library. That's fine for me and I'll click OK. So that's now exporting everything that I have in my library, which is quite a bit because when I first got my Silhouette, I had a subscription top of the line and I downloaded everything I could. Most of what I do nowadays though is my own designs and I save everything on my hard disk. So that's why I say I don't really use the library. So it's at about 30% now. It shows you about how long it takes. I think I've got about 4,000 designs in my library. So that gives you an idea. Just about at 70% now. Once you have installed your software, start up Silhouette Studio, come up to the Help menu, 
and click Upgrade Silhouette Studio. It's grayed out on mine because my license key is still active. If I had deactivated it here, this would be black and I would be able to click it and then enter my license key information there. And then you'll be ready to go. So what you need to do to install the new software or to install the software on your new computer is fire up your browser and then come to the Silhouette America website and the address is right over here www.silhouetteamerica.com then come down to the bottom of the page and you'll see here it says Silhouette Studio download now for free and you click that link and then again go down to the bottom or close to the bottom it's actually right over here where it says update and you choose either Mac or Windows and download and you'll see right now the version is 3.3.639 you would click download save that to your hard drive you'll see over here there's a progress bar showing how much is downloaded once it's done just click it and it will take you through the install process if you're still using version 2 and you don't want to upgrade to version 3, there is a legacy version available. So you just go all the way down to the bottom of the page. And it says here beta and legacy version. So here is your version 2.9.67. You can download for Mac or for Windows. Okay, so you need either version 2.9.67 to be able to access the Silhouette store and to be able to install your designer edition license code or business edition license code. After you've installed Silhouette Studio on your new computer, just come up to the file menu, choose library and import library, and then go back to where you had stored your backup. And that's in my Silhouette backup folder here. And here's my library. I would click OK and it would import all of my designs back into my library for me. So I hope this has been helpful to you. Thank you so much for watching and please remember to subscribe to my channel.